Well, coasters, uh, this is Clear Creek. Now, in the early 1900s, there was a dredge come through here, mining for gold. In fact, uh, I recall in the late 80s finding a couple of the buckets off it. Now, this area has just been levelled, cleared, signed off, uh, and Department of Cons Conservation, I understand, has sent a letter to the miner saying, You've done a great job. You should have seen this before Birchfields got here. It was a mess. It was unbelievable. So, real net gain here. Beautiful part of the country and, and an absolute massive resource of gold. Now, a lot of it's stewardship land. And when it comes to stewardship land, it belongs to New Zealand. It doesn't belong to DOC, it doesn't belong to the extreme greens, it belongs to New Zealand. And we're going to need it if we're going to dig our way out of the financial situation that we're going to be left with as uh, COVID continues. And I tell you what, we'll be, we'll be needing families like the Birchfield family, who've got the capital and the expertise to be able to extract the gold. And of course, don't forget, for the last 30 years, Birchfields have employed up to 30 men at a time, and they're not, they're not paid for, for pouring coffee. These guys are well-paid, experienced offer, operators. They've all bought houses, they've all got kids, they all buy their groceries locally. They've got kids going to school, keeping the school rolls up. If you took the mining out of Ross, you wouldn't have a, a policeman. We're lucky enough to have Jim, the local, the local policeman now. And there we go, folks. I would love to have had some shots of this before, but I knew it very well, but it never occurred to me to put the video on it. Just brilliant. Hey, have a great day.